What's something you still don't understand? Judgmental nature of humans. I mean everybody experiences it at some point. Then why do people still judge others wrongly and get so adamant that all they think they see or think they know about a person is all there is to them, despite of knowing how it feels to be judged wrongly by people? With such increased exposure to information of human nature in general states that judgmental ability is used for our survival to know if something front of us is a threat or no, which I still think is needed to see if someone could be a possible threat like if they are toxic or something else. But shouldn't it end there? We have evolved so much from the survival stage to understand that life is hard for everybody and we all act the way we do for our own personal reasons. But all that is overlooked and people judge for feeding their own ego by looking down on people. Which is something I still don't understand. No matter how many videos I watch about it or have people explain it to me I just don't understand how a record player works. The way you can put sound on pressed vinyl or even wax and then play it with a needle is just crazy to me. People's mad obsession with celebrities. Being a fan, appreciating their hard work and talents are a different thing. But intervening in their personal lives, obsessing so much so that they ignore their loved ones and their own life, then complaining about how shitty their life is. Some even go to the extent of trolling others for not liking a particular celebrity. In cell slash toxic masculinity. I'm a dude too. I was born here in America too. So, I grew up around similar things. I'm not getting laid either. I don't go around hating women and other people. And I'm Asian, so apparently, I have the added effect of being invisible to women too? Yet, still I don't have this hate that these people seem to have. I can't wrap my head around it. Parents that don't love their children. I will never understand that. I wish the only people that could have children were the ones that wanted them from the bottom of their hearts. Then we wouldn't have unloved or unwanted children out there. Why some people are so close-minded, it's genuinely not that hard to open up to new things. It's boring when you're stuck with the same mindset and almost your whole life. My dad sticks to his opinion and his opinion only. For example, if you told him your opinion, he'll tell you he doesn't care what you think. Another example is stuff like the abortion law, it's just people who think they're right about everything. I went a little off topic, but still. How people can have no curiosity and live willfully ignorant, while saying whatever nonsense they make up as if it's fact and just be okay living like that. It's remarkably easy to Google literally any piece of information. Wikipedia exists and is also remarkably well cited with sources. It's just absolutely beyond me. But no no, I'm the weird one because I read things to satiate my curiosity. Romantic and or sexual attraction. I'm arrow ace and I've never been able to see the appeal in that stuff, it just sounds uncomfortable to me, no matter how much my friends rant on about how much they love their so or something. I don't see the difference between a close friendship and a romantic relationship.